hello and welcome for you that are normal here on my channel this is going to be a little different from my normal video this is a collaboration video where jessica my rose is the host and there's several of us that are doing videos that are talking about our favorite five things for this month so be sure to check out the playlist it's listed down in the description along with jessica my rose link and be sure to go and check out their videos and see what their favorite items are for the rest of you hello and welcome I am Jackie with Jackie Russell Creates, where we talk about everything quilting. I hope to inspire you to create traditional patchwork quilts and some art quilts, whether they're big or they're small. My first favorite item isn't really an item. It's actually an app or a website, and it is Pinterest. I know that sounds crazy, but it is. I can go down the rabbit hole and spend hours and hours on Pinterest coming out with new ideas. But what I like to use it for is I go on and I find different ideas, different pictures, images, other quilts, coloring sheets, things like that, that I can actually take and incorporate and change it up and make it into a quilt or a wall hanging, a mug rug or something like that. Quilting is not just about taking a pattern that's already written and doing, you can create your own. And so I like to go on to Pinterest and find those different elements to be able to create a one of a kind, unique quilt that I actually share on my channel on how to, to make and create. So I'll leave my Pinterest link in the description so you can go and see some of the ideas that I actually save into the different boards to get my inspiration. My second item is my sewing machine. This is one of the two sewing machines that I own. And this is a Singer Heavy Duty. And I actually just started doing my machine quilting with the free motion on this machine. And it works tremendous. It does so much better than my other sewing machine does that now this is my go-to when it's time to quilt my machines or my quilt together it's so much easier to be able to maneuver and push the fabric through i can actually control it better it does have a little faster speed and i don't know if that has anything to do with it or if it's the bigger motor or what but it actually just is so much easier to do your free motion quilting so that's my second and i will list a link for this machine down in the description below my third item is heat and bond if you followed my channel for any time you know i love to do applique or piecing like paper piecing and this is the best stuff that i have found in my area to be able to do that i can be able to put it on the fabric and position it on my silicone mat and be able to still move it around until it is set in the position I want and then I can iron it and then it sticks to the fabric to each other until I can be able to get it quilted sometimes I don't always do the um, machine applique or hand applique right after I iron it and so this way it is sticking there until it I'm able to go back and finish sewing those pieces down it this one is temporary adhesive so you do have to sew but they do have a heat and bond ultra which is in the red package which is great for people that don't want to hand sew or applique stitch around their pattern <clears throat> so this is my one of my favorite items it's my go-to item for doing applique of any sort my fourth item is this ami grip ruler it is six inches wide by 24 inches long what i like about it is it has the measurements whether i'm cutting one side or the other they're the opposite like this goes one here but then i can flip it around and it has the one through five so i can be able to see the markings are very nice and easy to read it also has like a little texture on the back so that helps grip when you're pushing onto your fabric so it don't slip and slide so I really like that feature on it um, and I 
love that it has the 45, the 60 angle, and the 30 degree angle right here on the ruler as well. So then that way you can be able to mark those triangles or your half square triangles or what you know whatever you're trying to do with those degree angles. It makes it so much easier and you have one ruler instead of multiples. I will link this down in the description as well. But you can even get some smaller ones. You don't have to have quite as long. I like to have the length because that way when I bring a piece of fabric home from the store, I'm able to square it up with this ruler versus, you know, having a smaller ruler and having to move and move and move. So I like this length. Plus, this will fit a fat quarter. You'll be able to cut a fat quarter easily with this ruler. And my last item is this little foot. It is a quarter inch foot. And I like it because if you line your fabric up over here on the edge, you're going to get that perfect quarter inch every time. It also has these little markings on the feet. So this lets you know if I stitch to here, I done went, you know, my quarter inch. Then I can be able to rotate and pivot my fabric and continue to stitch to get that perfect quarter inch. And we all know that you have to have a quarter inch seam allowance when you're doing quilting to get that perfect piece in your quilt to be able to lay flat and in the dimensions that you're wanting it to go. Well, I hope you liked my favorite fives this month. And if it, and I hope that it was something that inspired you to be able to go and try something new in your quilting journey. We all have a journey when it comes to quilting. We all do something different um, and makes it what's unique about quilting. So I would like to know what you, your favorite item is this month that you have used in any of your quilting journeys or any of your other craft items or even if it's like your favorite makeup your favorite lipstick what was your favorite item this this month for july comment below and let me know and if you're new here and you feel like sticking around please hit that subscribe button and that notification bell so you know the next time that i upload a video i upload most tuesdays thursdays and saturdays and we have fun here. We enjoy quilting. And I hope you will too. Until then, happy quilting my friends. And be sure to check out the other people in this playlist. And see what their favorite five things were for this month.